our Super Contest Picks. Again, it's brought to you every week by BetUS, where the game begins. Last week, Chris and I both went 3-2 and two on the season. My best bets are 34-21 and 21 against the number. Uh, Chris is sitting at 27-26-2. Got two pushes in the first two weeks of the season. So let me go on and give you what my top five picks are this week. Going to start off on Thanksgiving. I like the Bears minus the three at the Lions. Uh, The Lions do not have success on Thanksgiving. The Bears, yes, there are issues there. I just think that they are the significantly better football team. I think they got more playmakers. I think they are ready to roll in this spot. This defense will be able to shut down Jared Goff. Look for some turnovers in this game. Uh, I think that's how the Bears end up uh, separating themselves from the Lions. Give me the Bears minus three. I also like the Steelers plus four on the road at the Bengals. Uh, I don't get it. I don't know how they are keeping this together with paper clips and uh, popsicle sticks and you know glue sticks and whatever. But the Steelers find a way to either stay in games close or just win games outright that they're not supposed to. And on the road, the Steelers have kind of had the Bengals number. I will take the Steelers to be able to cover the four against the Bengals. This looks like it might be a field goal game either way. Uh, give me give me the plus four on this one. The Falcons headed to the Jacksonville Jaguars, and Urban Meyer kind of maybe turning things around a little bit. That team is actually playing together a little bit. Trevor Lawrence has looked okay. I will take the Jaguars to win at home plus one against the Falcons. Uh, Falcons are not a good football team. They're just not, and I think the Jags are going to have some success. A scoring, they've got a ton of a ton of skill talent that they will be able to take advantage of a weak Falcon secondary. Uh, Give me the Jags plus the one. Other one, down in Florida. Panthers, minus two at the Dolphins. Uh, Bringing in Cam Newton has rejuvenated that football team for whatever reason. Uh, The Panthers, of course, have had a good defense anyway. Look, you give me that matchup all day long. Give me Cam Newton, minus two at the Dolphins. I think they're going to be fired up, and that defense is going to take care of Tua and that bunch uh, down in Miami. I don't know what has happened to this Dolphins team, but they cannot get out of their own way, and I will take the, I guess I could say, better coach team at this point, the team that makes less mistakes. How's that? Give me the Panthers minus two. And finally, I will take the Eagles minus three and a half at the Giants. Of course, the offensive coordinator, Jason Garrett, for the New York Giants has been fired. I don't know that that necessarily means anything. This Eagles team has been rolling with their stud wide receivers, Devontae Smith, Jalen Rager, all that bunch, and Jalen Hurts has been playing out of his mind. Just absolutely playing out of his mind. I, I like this Eagles team. I like the offense right now. It doesn't make sense in my head compared to what I thought this team was in the preseason and what I assumed that Jalen Hurts would be. But he has developed incredibly. I like what they're doing. Give me... The Eagles, minus three and a half at the New York Giants. That is going to wrap things up for today's show. We certainly appreciate you being here. Tell your friends about the show. Of course, we will have a special Thanksgiving live show. We appreciate you all for being here for that one. That's the college football show. Going to be a little bit longer. I'm going to have my buddy Parker in for that, I, I believe. I hope. We'll see. We'll see what happens with it. So everything is fluid at this point, especially with a short week. But with that said... Make sure and check out the picks. You can find them over on the website. I'll have the spreadsheet updated quickly, so go ahead and find that as well. Tell your friends about the show. Leave some comments. Make sure and like the video, and make sure you are subscribed to the podcast. With all of that said, take care of yourself. Take care of each other. Hopefully, you all have wonderful Thanksgivings, and hopefully, all of your tickets cash this week. Thanks for listening to the Winning Cures Everything podcast. The website is winningcureseverything.com, and if you want to connect with us, we're on Twitter, at GaryWCE, at ChrisBGiannini, at Winning Cures, or you can email us, Gary at winningcureseverything.com, or Chris at winningcureseverything.com. Subscribe everywhere you need to subscribe, and we'll see you soon.